really expensive to work with mice or with other mammals and so if you're a, um, you know, a research institution you spend a huge amount of grant income on actually carrying out the experiments in mammals and research larvae, the larvae that we produce are a fraction of the cost of working with mammals. Everybody who used the larvae had to actually buy them as fishing bait they would have to go online to fish, like to tackle shops or stop off at their local pet shops and buy, you know, tubs of grubs that they used in the lab for their research. And obviously, you know, as a scientist, that's kind of, well, introducing into your research an unacceptable level of variability. We breed them from a defined genetic background. We've genome sequenced the breeding colony. Um, and so we know that all the larvae come from the same genetic stock. The larvae are age-defined and they're weight-defined. They're surface decontaminated. 